In this tutorial, we're going to be showing the application of a pre-designed nail tip. In this case, it's the faded glitter stiletto nail tip from Shiba Nails applied with the gel acrylic system. As with all services, it is important to begin with the proper preparation of the nail. In this case, we disinfect the nail with Shiba Nails disinfectant sanitizer, then push back the cuticles removing any debris. Now using a light buffer, you want to buff away any of the shine from the natural nail bed. Apply Shiba Nails resin or any quality glue to the nail tip, only into the area that's going to be glued directly onto the nail bed itself. Starting from the free edge of the nail tip, gently press down towards the cuticle area. This will push up any excess resin that you may have applied to the nail tip keeping any bubbles from forming between the nail bed and the nail tip itself and ensuring proper adhesion to the nail. Using bent tweezers, gently squeeze the nail tip to the nail bed itself. Using Shiba Nails Resin Activator, just one quick spray will dry the glue instantly. Here we're going to be applying the gel acrylic gels itself to the nail. This comes in either a UV or LED formulation. Gently brush the gel starting at the cuticle area down to the nail tip free edge, being sure to steer clear from the skin from the sidewalls and the cuticle area itself. If needed, with a cuticle stick, clear around the edges prior to curing. Now here for 30 seconds under a UV lamp. After curing the nail for 30 seconds, we're ready for our second coat of gel acrylic gel. Again, gently brush the gel starting from the cuticle area down to the free edge of the nail tip. In this case, we're going to be dipping the nail into gel acrylic gel powder clear, or you can always use a scooper application to sprinkle the acrylic powder onto the nail. This time, cure the nail for 60 seconds under a UV lamp. After curing the nail for 60 seconds, we're going to apply another coat of the gel acrylic gel to the nail. From the cuticle down to the free edge, cover the entire nail, steering clear of any of the skin area. Then you go ahead and dip your nail into the gel acrylic powder clear, or you can always use a spoon applicator to sprinkle the powder onto the nail itself. Cure the nail for 60 seconds under a UV lamp. Now we are ready for our final coat of our gel acrylic gel. It's the same application, start again from the cuticle area down to the free edge of the nail tip covering the entire nail with the gel acrylic gel. Always remember to make sure that you don't apply any of the gel to the skin area around the cuticle or the sidewalls. If you, this should happen, make sure that you clean it with a cuticle stick prior to curing. This time, cure the nail under the UV lamp for three minutes. After curing for three minutes under a UV lamp, use a UV gel finishing cleanser to remove the tacky dispersion layer from the nail. For this step, alcohol or alcohol wipes can also be used. I like the finishing cleanser as it does have softening products that keep the skin from drying out. After the nail has been cleaned off, you will have high gloss, shiny finish that requires no filing or buffing. This step is optional. I will be applying Sheba Nails Botanical Oil to the cuticle area. This one is Sweet Apple and there are a variety of scents available. Simply brush on and rub in with the finger. It is great to keep nails looking healthy, cuticles from peeling or looking dry and can be applied as needed throughout the day. At this point, you can leave as is, or 
you can just use this as a base for a great nail art application, adding rhinestones or hand painted designs, whatever you may desire.